Springs City Council member is facing a possible censure. That's after he called out several city council members over a proposed apartment complex. Dave Donaldson says he has ethics concerns, but the city council president says there's no conflict of interest. We're hearing from both sides tonight. 11 News reporter Jared Dean's live from outside City Hall. Jared Donaldson says this all started when he pointed out campaign donations that several city council members have received. Yeah, Adam and Lindsay, and those donations came from the Widener Property Management Group. They're the ones who own the, would own the proposed apartment complex, Arrow West Apartments, which would be built on the west side of Colorado Springs. Do you believe with all of this that Councilmember Donaldson was acting out of line and outside of where he should be? Oh, absolutely. Yes. That's how City Council President Randy Helms is responding after Tuesday's meeting. When Colorado Springs City Council member Dave Donaldson says he raised an issue regarding campaign funds given to four other council members by the Widener Group. That company wants to build the Arrow West apartment complex here near 30th and Garden of the Gods. The citizens are going to feel that uh, the jury is stacked here. I'm not, I'm just not going to put up with that. In the video, Council President Randy Helms asked Donaldson to stop bringing up the topic, saying he was imputing their integrity. In a news conference, Donaldson says he was speaking on behalf of voters. As the representative of District 1, I am not going to be told not to. If there are questions, I think the, the citizens of District 1, the constituents would ask. Uh, if they had the information I have, I'm going to ask that question. I'm not going to be told not to ask it. As Council President, I cannot let other council members violate these uh, policies and rules that we have set forth for all of us. Now, Helm says a special session is planned for next week. Council members will vote on whether or not Donaldson should be censured and if he should lose his roles on committees and councils. Helm says the special session does not have to take place if Donaldson apologizes and moves on. I'm not going to apologize if I'm representing the, the, the people that elected me. Earlier tonight, I spoke with council member David Lineweber. He's one of the four council members who received funding from the Widener Group, and he tells me these donations are common practice in politics. Live in Colorado Springs, Jared Dean, KKTV 11 News. And we'll continue to follow this and that meeting coming up on Tuesday. Jared, thanks.